if you are having trouble to getting the high gpu usage while you gaming so in this video i'm going to show you how you can fix low gpu usage and get maximum potential performance out of your any gpu on your any pc in any game so guys welcome to my channel please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and with wasting any time let's dive straight into over this video so guys in the very first step we are going to disable over gpu and power throttling on our windows that is causing the low gpu usage while we playing games so guys for that press windows are together from your keyboard and type here gpu edit.msc and press enter now go for computer configuration administrative template system now scroll down and there you will find a power management now go for power throttling settings and there you will find out turn or power throttling inside you will find out this kind of settings so you need to enable the settings for turning off the power throttling after that hit apply and click ok and close out your these settings now in the next step you need to download these files on your pc link will be down in the description and you can download it from my official website once you download these files on your pc now here you will find out nvidia profile inspector msa afterburner and reverse static tuner server so open up this rar file so right click here and click on the extract to nvidia profile inspector you will find out this folder open up this folder inside you will find out this exe file so double tap here hit yes and here you will find out this kind of the interface now the next step you need to search for the game in which you want to fix the low gpu usage and you are getting the low gpu usage problem so guys you need to go for the profile section so for example i want to fix the low gpu usage in fortnite so you need to search for fortnite and there you will find out your game now you need to scroll down and go straight toward anti anything option there you will find out this anti anything super sampling so go for this option click on the drop down and set it on to the 0x00008 double a mode replay mode all so set the settings onto this option after that you need to scroll down and there you will find our texture filtering so now you need to go for texture filtering lod bios dx click onto the drop down and simply set the setting onto the 0 0.5000 now go for next settings which is texture filtering lod bios ogl so go for this option click on the drop down and again set the settings onto the 0 0.500 make sure to set the same exact value here now you need to go for this option that is the texture filtering quality and set it onto the high performance once you have set up these settings in the nvidia profile inspector click on the apply button and this will help you to increasing your gp performance and also increasing your fps in all the games so guys now the next step you need to open up ms afterburner on your pc and guys we are going to slightly and safely overclock our gpu that is not actually overclocking but help you a lot to increasing your gp performance on the maximum potential so guys you need to go straight toward your fan section and there you will find out this power limit option into the ms afterburner so guys go for the slider and set it onto the maximum available into the software after applying the settings now you need to click on the apply button and apply the settings in the ms afterburner and guys by the way once you install the ms afterburner on your pc you will also find out the software that is the reva static tuner server so you need to go for your windows search and search for reva and you will find out this reva tuner static server so right click and open up this application as administrator so here is the interface of the reverse static tuner server now you need to guys simply change a few settings that is important so now you need to guys click on this add button now you need to go for the directory where you install your specific game in which you are getting the low fps and low gpu usage so guys simply go for this pc after that go for c drive where you install your fortnite go for program file epic games fortnite Fortnite game binary win 64 and guys as usual you need to follow the directory where you install your that specific game in which you are problem so guys here is my fortnite i will add here this exe file click on this open button and guys this will add here that specific game or you can simply go with the global option and now the settings you need to change here into the reverse direct to the server that is frame rate limiter and guys this application will help you to fixing the status problem while you playing any game and also help you to managing your cpu and gp performance so guys you need to go for this frame rate limiter option and now you need to adjust here fps according to your pc specs you can also ask me in the comment section according to your specs and i will suggest you the best frame rate limit option into this application so for example i have a good pc and i want to fix the low gpu usage so i will set my fps on 240 fps and simply press enter and this will limit my fps on 240 in every single game so guys that's it now click on this minimize button and this application will keep running in your background also click on the minimize 
and this will also keep running in your background make sure to run the ms afterburner before launching any game on your pc so guys now in the next step we are going to optimize our windows registry settings so guys for that we are going to set up or optimize our timeout detection recovery settings on our windows so guys for that you need to navigate to word hk local machine click on the drop down after that go for system and click on the drop down now you need to go for current control set and click on the drop down again open up control click on the drop down and now you need to find out here graphics drivers option so guys you need to scroll down until you find out here graphics drivers option so guys you need to click on this graphics driver now right click here go for new and click on the d word 32 bit value now type here t d r delay with the same capitalization after that press enter now guys right click here go for modify click on the base on the hexadecimal after that go for the value data and set it onto the 8 now click on this ok button and save the settings into this application so guys now the next step we are going to optimize the best power plan settings on our window so guys for that go for your window search and search for power and open up power and sleep settings on your windows simply go into the additional power settings now you need to go for the show power plan settings click onto the high performance power plan go for change power plan settings and open up advanced power settings on your windows now you need to go for hard disk and simply set this turn off hard disk option onto the zero so go for this option and set it onto the zero now you need to scroll down go for processor power management click on the expand button now you need to go for maximum processor state click on the expand and set the settings onto the 100 percent after that go for the minimum processor state click on the drop down and also set the settings on to the 100 percent now here is another most important settings that is the system cooling policy so go for the expand button and set it on to the activate after applying the settings on your pc hit apply and click ok and close out these power settings now in the final and the last step we are going to optimize the best control panel settings on our windows so guys open up your nvidia amd or intel control panel and now you need to simply find out here the power settings so go for 3d image settings now you can guys choose any settings according to your need you can watch a lot of other video on youtube the best nvidia control panel settings but the most settings you guys change here for your gp performance that is your power plan settings so guys scroll down and there you will find out this power management mode click on the drop down and set it on to the prefer maximum performance after that hit apply and save the settings in the nvidia control panel so guys that's it for this video i hope so you love it please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and tell me in the comment section about your thoughts and feedback about this optimization so guys see you in the next video